about to jump on a call. I'm going to do a podcast interview for um, Cozy White Cottage Seasons that's coming out this November. If you haven't pre-ordered, swipe up, check it out. Um, thank you guys for your pre-orders. I know I say that a lot, but I am very thankful. But before I jump on that podcast interview, I did want to show you two things. So let's go look at the first thing. Look what came in the mail this morning. The Nugget Ice Maker. You got to clean her up and then it will be making ice. It says 15 minutes. Oh, wow. 15 to 20 minutes. I'm equal parts nervous and excited. You guys saw the price of this thing. Um, I... I, I don't know. I'm glad there's like a money back guarantee, um, but so many people raved about it. And this is part of my health journey where I think it will help me drink more water. And currently we have this fridge right here and then we have the Smeg and they both do not have ice makers and I'm not great at remembering to make ice. So I'm hoping that this helps. I will keep you posted. We also made it a highlight um, with all of your reviews I included in there. Not all of them because there was probably a million, um, but a lot of the reviews, um, the link to it and everything, but I will keep you posted with my honest review. My hopes are pretty low for it. So I'm like, like keeping the box. I'm like thinking I'm going to return it, but who knows? I may love it. Stay Talk class for me. Oh, phone and see. I am done with my podcast interview and I wanted to quickly talk to you guys about this before I need to go blueberry picking with my son. So anyways, on the blog, you'll see a lot more of this today, but we got this piece for the mudroom and our initial plan was that we got this piece for more closed storage. The other one had open storage. I wanted a water source in the greenhouse. And so that piece was perfect for the greenhouse. And then I shifted this one in here. Um, I was to put a sink in the top okay and now that it's in here I'm like oh do I want to modify it to put a sink in it I'm a little scared of that so anyways I got to thinking and I was like a do I need a water source in here can it just stay like this uh, B or I don't know what my plan two was oh I guess plan B is to put the sink in there that's that's plan B but plan C is this piece in here this large tall pine piece I was thinking of swapping C is flipping this piece that is in the back living room with this piece and we would obviously modify this it would fill in this whole spot it'd be great to store farm items in shoes mail paperwork all of that stuff and it's very slim it's way slimmer than this one so it would be very low profile on this wall and very beautiful and then this piece could go in that room and we could put the frame TV above it and it could be a great um, TV stand and it would be great storage for books, DVDs, toys, all of that stuff. So um, this is where the TV is now in here. Um, we have that frame TV. I could shift it over here above this piece and actually I could flip this TV with a bigger TV that we have so we could have a bigger TV over here. But anyways, those are my ideas. Vote here. What do you think? Help me decide. <laughs> you guys are. I'm the animal together. I'm the animal together. Let the animal together. You have to feed the animals together? Oh! A dinosaur! Oh,
I'm a dinosaur. You're a dinosaur? Bye. Bye. Bye.